okay once this is done then i'll go for a merging concept like okay so now i want to see all together as uh, passes like merged passes so i'm going to use a merge so i'm going to use the merge i'm going to connect um, this a pipe here and okay i'm going to use a constant to keep my projects the size like uh, you know um, so as a project setting so b pipe i'm going to connect as the ideal one then i'm going to see uh, now i can see only the ambient pass okay good so i'm going to connect again use my merge okay so once the merge so a and to b okay so now through this merge i'm going to see now uh, make sure that okay i'm going to use a hundred percent view uh, so here maybe so that i can see what is blending is happening actually uh, that's good okay so this is over and with the diffuse i'm going to uh over two i'm going to use um, screen mode is good i think uh, you see the screen mode now you see the thing before and after one ambient with the diffuse yeah that's good so using my merge again once again uh, go to my a pipe and b pipe uh, so i'm connecting this to my merge uh, this is my indirect pass so instead of over actually over is 100 percent opaque so that's the reason i'm adding it on right now uh, so this is a general concept every terms people know this anyway i am going to use like either plus if want more brightness or something of course like you can use anything uh, so i'm going to use something like even soft light to try now see uh, this is good but we can change it anyway anytime uh, like it depends like all ways we have the choice here mm, so i'm going to use the screen mode now it's quite uh, look like additive but also we have the choice here like you know uh, so you have the the mix concept like either you want to pack based like uh, 0.5 you want to affect uh, the indirect of course you can use anyway but doesn't matter um, we think that it's uh, too much of brightness so once if you add ambient occlusion and shadow so you can see the the proper element merging here so i'm going to use the merge again once go to b pipe and go to a pipe so i'm going to connect with my ambient occlusion right now i can't see uh, the blending so just go to over i'm going to uh, enable the multiply mode is great uh, for uh, the darken passes so it's choice is yours again see now before ambient occlusion after ambient occlusion now you can see your sub level shadows here so i'm going to use the merge again go to my a pipe sorry b pipe to a pipe and connect here my shadow pass so again i can use a multiply either like i'm going for the average or something like that now you see connect here connect with my average yeah this is all controlled but also we can able to control through the mix anyway uh, so uh, um, again uh, like i'm going to say for example now why don't you change something like a color burn or any anything all the modes you can check it out like um, which is like a color dodge now check before and after yeah this fine okay again uh, like okay let it be like i just keep it as uh, average right now uh, later on i might change with the grading concept anyway uh, so go to my merge again uh, so i'm going to use the b pipe and the a pipe to my specular so mostly the specular and uh, the reflection passes uh, we can use additive mode is good because it's uh, light layers anyway uh, so go to plus now so now you see before and after okay the purposely i given in the pongi um, pongi material uh, because of just i want to see uh, the cover the portion of the specular uh, later on um, i'll cover with the reflection also like uh, with the different examples okay so now we have connected uh, all together like uh, now we have seen this passes with the merged passes now we'll go for the further um, improvements also okay i'll stop this video we'll continue with the next video